So there's a counter argument to that, where if you do tax it, some people are still going to sell it illegally because it's going to be cheaper. Now, you know, the, the whole thing about education, all of that stuff, you know, that's a libertarian position you're making there. Will it become a national thing? There was a time nobody thought marijuana was going to be legal. And right. today nobody cares about, you know, the le- whether right. marijuana is legal or not. Right. So, I don't know. It's, I, but the problem is when things are illegal and there's a demand for those things, criminals sell those things. And then those criminals become insanely powerful and wealthy. And that's what you see in Mexico. That's what you see with the cartels. It's a direct result of the policies of the United States and the war on drugs. How do you solve it? The whole thing with legalizing it? Well, you got to tear the Band-Aid off. And that's what scares people, is that there's going to be a lot of problems. There's going to be a lot of people that are addicted. There's going to be a lot of people that overdose. There's going to be a lot of people that... What age should a person, if they want to try marijuana or smoke weed, what age is an appropriate age to smoke weed? Well... I think you've talked about this before in the past. I do not think children should be regular users of anything that perturbs your state of consciousness. I don't think they should drink. I don't think they should smoke pot. I don't think they should try acid. I don't think they should do anything. Your mind is in a developing state. That's, there's like real documentation about that. I also think you can't tell kids what to do because they're going to do the opposite of what you tell them to do. You know, what I tell my kids is there are drugs that are very dangerous and you should be very careful about yeah. drugs that are dangerous. Don't take drinks from someone that you don't know. Don't ever take a pill. Don't ever, don't ever snort something. Don't ever do something where you don't know where it's coming from. Mm-hmm.